when you're watching Jaw score the last 15 points of the game <laughs> like that, I, what goes through your mind as that's developing? Mama, there goes that man. Nah, he's a bucket. Is this on? Can you hear me? Yeah, no, he's a bucket for sure. Uh, and especially in the clutch time, like he knows how to get to where he wants to be. Uh, as a defender, I, I don't know what they're thinking in the head, but it's hard to stop him for sure. Okay. X, uh, you guys were better defensively tonight. You're more physical tonight. Uh, what did what can you take from this game to take it on the road with you? Same mentality, um, especially on the on the rebounds, making sure that we're crashing the offensive rebounds and then we're boxing them out on that end too. Um, physicality helps a lot in transition, helps us get out and run, helps slow them down if we're getting offensive rebounds and putbacks or offensive rebounds and threes. Um, yeah, but that physicality is something for sure that we're going to bring over there. Uh, no, I mean, I saw that he, <laughs> I saw that he had like, ah, my eye. I don't remember what part of the game it was, but it was before that, um, way before that. And then, no, I didn't know he was experiencing it still. With with the stuff you've seen him do? Um, I feel like I've just watched him transform into like a, a true closer. You know what I mean? Where like, at first I said, okay, I'm going to hit the open guy. Okay, now I'm going to take the shot. I'm missing it. Ah. Uh, but, like, now he's like, no, nah, I got it. Like, last three minutes, like, I got it. Don't even worry about it. And, you know, it's hard for the defense to stop that. Um, X, so tonight uh, college coach Tom Izzo comes to this game, and, you know, out on the court, you're, you're going up against Draymond, another Spartan whose game you've always modeled your game after, and you're also starting alongside Jaron, your college teammate. Just what does that moment right there just, like, mean to you right there? Uh, it'll probably be, be bigger for me later on. Right now, I'm kind of liked at the moment. It was awesome for him to come down here, and bring Malik and AJ and Steve-O. Um, it's great to see those guys for sure. But, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm locked in right now. So, like, later on when I look back on it, but, yeah, that's crazy to have all those Spartans in, in the same building at once for sure. I hear X. Hey. Okay. So, um, defensively and defensive rebounding, just trying to find it at Wiggins, it's like he's the will of the wisp. He finds a way to get the ball. What is it that you guys have to do to try to keep him off the boards? Because he is really the reason that they have out rebounded the Grizzlies the last couple of games. Yeah. Um, funny thing is, he's like the only guy crashing. So sending more people to box him out is going to help us out a lot. Sometimes we leave it just to one guy, and he's crazy athletic. He's fast. He's strong. You know, he can jump. So. We need to send uh, more than one guy at him, especially if other guys aren't crashing the boards, for sure. Any final questions? We'll finish with Megan. Xavier, you said during pregame that you just need to play better. You're very blunt with that. When you look at what you're able to do and the amount of minutes that you played and when it comes to the glass and the steals, what did you see tonight and how did you kind of, you know, evaluate your performance? Definitely better. Um, I've... I felt like I was more free. I learned from my mistakes, and then I just let my instincts take over um, and try not to repeat the same mistakes for sure. But um, definitely better for sure. I would say today was probably like a B plus. Yeah.